Let me tell you a story. Once a great scholar met a mystique and asked him, Is it possible that a man can envision the truth? The mystique asked him, What is truth? Or what did he mean by truth? So the scholar replied that truth is that unconditional prerequisite for equilibrium. The mystique replied that unconditionality can only exist beyond the cycles of cause and effect. Therefore, it cannot be seen or envisioned. Now the scholar replied that I can see beyond the cycles of cause and effect. So I should be able to envision the truth. Mystic told him, okay, prove it. So the scholar picked up a seed from the ground and held it in his palm and said, I can see the seed which is in the tree, which is in the seed. I can see beyond the cycles of cause and effect. Now the mystic smiled and he said, hmm, but can you see the trees which are in the seeds, which are in the trees, which are in the seeds, which are in the trees, which is in that seed? Now the scholar fell silent. The mystic told him, See, you see too much, but and yet you see too less. He told him that if there is truth at all, if there is truth that does exist, it must be that seed which is in his palm. But he really doubt that the seed that the scholar thinks that he is holding in his palm does exist at all. Now the scholar fell silent again in deep thought and then finally he asked the mystique that does he think that truth does not exist at all? Now the mystique replied that the truth that we see is conditional and it does not exist. And the truth, which is unconditional, does exist. But unfortunately, we cannot see it. Know that as mankind's greatest predicament.